Hey everyone, today we'll be going over the TrackMan Go app for the iPhone today. Download the TrackMan Go app from the App Store and then click Shot Analysis once connected to your TrackMan and then this is where we'll start seeing some of the parameters. In the lower right hand corner, if you hit Settings, this is where you can select or deselect whatever parameters you want to be shown and this is also where you can toggle on or off normalization. You can also select what club and tag that club as well by selecting the club and tag feature on the bottom left and then selecting the tag up top by hitting the add tag, type in whatever tag you want to add to that certain club, then click add, then click done, and then now you can see that tag is now added to that club. You can go through shot history by selecting the shot feature in the bottom left hand corner as well as selecting your normalization features or by selecting the top right icon in the top right corner then clicking normalization. This is where you can edit the temperature and altitude as well. You can also select under the units tab what units you want the track lane to be measured in, so whether you will be in yards or meters. And you can also select what language you want this app to be in by selecting the appropriate language you're looking for. Under the general tab, this is where you can see what serial number and track lane you connected to with whatever firmware you're running, or you can select the green icon in the top top right hand corner and this is where you can see what serial number you're connected to and the battery percentage as well. One of the new features in the TrackMan Go app is adding corridors to certain parameters. So in the bottom right hand corner if you hit that corridors icon and then you can see here we want to see attack angle be within zero and negative five. Now if we look at a shirt a certain shot we can see that attack angle is within that window so it highlights green if it was outside that window that tile will be highlighted red my favorite new feature on this app is highlighting actual versus normalization carry distances by selecting that settings icon in the bottom right turning on normalization and turning on display actual data you can see we can display an actual carry and normalized carry at the same time rather than toggling back and forth like the old classic app. Now that we have some shots selected, in the bottom left hand corner you can select the shot icon and this will bring up all the different shots and tags we have in this session. You can see it's labeled by color and club so a little easier to navigate. And in the upper right hand corner, you can select what parameter you want to be highlighted within all tags. So it's a little, a little bit more user friendly and easier to find. This app will continue to be updated with more features like impact location and ball tracing. So make sure you stay up to date with the newest app and please subscribe to our YouTube channel.